background. I don't know how I feel because it looks not how it looked on the um, website. Hey guys, what is up? I am back. I honestly feel like I haven't filmed anything. I, haven't, I feel like I haven't sat here in front of the camera for so long because there has been a lot going on. Um, but luckily I had a whole bunch of pre-shot um, footage and stuff so I, I, I hope it didn't look like, I don't think it looked like I was gone but um, yeah I had not been filming anything for probably like two, two-ish weeks. Yeah, probably like two-ish weeks. So for me that felt like a long time and I can't believe that I had like two weeks worth of like footage um, already like pre-recorded uh, for you guys. Anyway, so, um, so I have been really, really busy um, with work. I am a brand ambassador, so um, I was busy working with an event that was um, held here in New York last weekend. It was New York Comic Con. Um, New York Comic Con is a big festival convention, I guess you could say, um, in New York from, I, I believe it's always the first um, weekend of October from the Thursday to the um, Sunday. And it's a big festival um, dedicated to comic books and anime and video games and gaming and you know, all that kind of stuff. <laughs> all that kind of stuff that I'm not really into, but I mean, I was there um, uh, to work a booth. Um, and it's funny because I was talking so, uh, to some of my friends and they were laughing because they're like, you were at Comic-Con? <laughs> You're not the type of person I could ever see going to Comic Con, and it's true. But um, it was a really, really interesting experience. Uh, I will definitely say that. Um, you definitely expect to see a lot of nerds <laughs> and a lot of dorks. That's kind of like what people associate Comic Con with, like nerds and dorks and stuff like that. And yeah, there were plenty of that. The things that I heard, the things that I saw, if I hope that I have to check on Instagram to see if they have a um, overheard Comic Con like they have a overheard New York um, account because I heard some hilarious things. But what was interesting though is that I did see a lot of people who didn't look like they fit in. Like they looked like normal people, like normal New Yorkers. So I guess like anyone can be interested in comics and like anime and like a lot of people took their kids and stuff like that. Um, so yeah, that was kind of like, um, my deal for last weekend. Um, it was very interesting, fun. So I just, um, took some footage here and there wherever I could. Um, it was a little bit difficult because we were, we were so busy, um, at our booth. Um, it was a t-shirt company that I was working for based out of Michigan. Um, so yeah, it was, it was like long days, barely any breaks, <laughs> craziness. Madness. So I didn't have like a lot of time in between, but whenever I did here and there, um, I tried to film stuff. Um, so I am just going to roll my film and um, show you guys what Comic-Con New York is about. If you if it looks like something you're interested in, it, like I said, it's always the first um, weekend of October in New York. But it's nationwide within the United States. So, I mean, this weekend coming up, they're going to be in Chicago. Um, they had one in San Diego. They had one in Orlando, Miami, um, Atlanta, um, everywhere. So, you can just Google it. So, anyways, I hope you guys enjoy the rest of my vlog.
Thank you.
I forgot to mention I'm literally running on four hours of sleep. I'm exhausted. I'm sure you can tell by the way that I look I'm just exhausted. But um yeah. I'm so glad that um I'm doing this event. It's a lot cooler than what I thought. Never was really interested in this event, but um it's a fun experience, you know? And I didn't have to pay for a ticket. <laughs> so I'm working the event. So I'm working for this company called Stylin Online and this is a booth that goes all the way around. T-shirts, 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 and then all inside it as well. So we have toddlers, are these called toddlers? No, infants. We have pants, um, women's luxury shirts, sweatshirts on that end. And this end is kids and toddlers. On this end, we have like general, like men. Inside is all men's wear. And then, kind of sexist, but <laughs> the only section that we have for women is this. And yeah, that's pretty much our well, ooh, got some really cute designs and um, like t-shirts. I should show you the other side. From inside, um, this is probably like the biggest section. The men's, but you know what they say it's men's, but I feel like t-shirts can go pretty unisex. There's some styles of t-shirts that are more feminine cut, but like. I mean, these types, the ones that are, I guess, for guys, like, that you can wear them too. So, yeah. Comic Con 2019. Here are my two favorite girls. Hey! Hey, what's up? You're on my vlog. Oh my god, this My two favorite girls. And the kids' stuff is really, really adorable. Are you pretending like you're working? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, are you? We're working hard. You're working so hard. Working Just hard. like you were last night at um, 7, 10 p.m. I after we were, we were supposed to be done at 7 o'clock and they didn't let us, uh, they didn't cut us yet, so we're like pretending to work. Yeah, this is the <laughs> easiest way. Just pretend that you're doing something. And if you're working in corporate, just tap on the computer. Yeah, and yeah. Move your mouse around. Yeah. Just close your Instagram every once exactly. in a while, you know? <laughs> uh, break's over. Break's over. Hey, <laughs> <laughs> thank you. Comic Con, I'm exhausted, and it's funny because everyone's like, all the security people, are like, yeah, it's the last day, it's the last day. I totally feel that. I mean, I'm so excited for today to be over with. It's just been a lot of work. It's been exhausting because it's been like the whole day, the whole entire day, well, freaking hours. I probably, there's a whole other side 
but um, I just haven't really been able to explore that side because I'm always just like rushing to get to our booth because um, we can't be late and stuff like that. Obviously everything in the morning gets reset up and stuff. So I don't know what goes on on half these things, but this looks like something different. I haven't walked on this side before. There's a lot of stuff. There's like a lot, a lot of stuff. I just haven't been able to really um, walk around. And today we have to take everything down. So it's like I probably won't be able to after the event's over. There is our t-shirt booth. Is it? Well, we have two booths. Oh, you know what? This is our other our second booth. I haven't seen it and I haven't really known where it's at, but I've been directing people here if we don't have a shirt that they're looking for. I know because it's right next to Marvel. I've been telling people it's right next to the Marvel booth, but I haven't known exactly where that's at. I hope I've been giving the right number. Oh no, I've been saying 1400. But it's actually at 1300. Oh well, it's done anyways. <laughs> this is interesting. I haven't seen this side. And of course, this is one side of one side of one side of one side because this place goes on and on like Narnia. Our booth stylinonline.com. Interesting company based out of Michigan. But it's like a national company because they have people employed everywhere. Like um, most of the staff is from the office here. Like from everywhere from Florida to California to. Um, there's a girl from Seattle. Okay, why are we tapered together? This early 